What it do, dudes? This is Great White making it happen again today with some more Minecraft. We're back at it, back in the Minecraft world, and uh, yeah. So jumping right in here, uh, you know how I said that I thought I fixed the fire problem with the uh, with the town center where the you know the um, fire kept spreading and burning down my building. Yeah, I thought I had fixed that. Apparently, I was wrong. Oh, oh, God. Oh, I just destroyed everything. I got rid of the fire. We're not going to have fire in there anymore. This took so long to do. Oh. Look. Look at all the damage. I actually got more work done. I did more to it. And I was so excited to show you guys. And then this happened. Oh, God. Why? 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 Why can't fire spread just not be a thing? <laughs> oh, God. It's gonna take so long to fix it. Oh, okay. I'm gonna fix that. <laughs> Let me do that really quick. And I'll bring you guys back and show you what we're doing today. <laughs> Talk to you in like, like five hours. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Thanks a lot for being patient. I appreciate it. So I got it all fixed up. We're uh, <laughs> we're back to normal. I got rid of the lava so it doesn't happen again. But here's how things are looking, guys. I'm feeling real good about it. So. We got the uh, windows put up along the walls, you can see, um, over here as well. Windows along the wall, up on the top. Um, I got windows here. Oh, it's nighttime. Good. I'm so good at this timing thing. <laughs> but uh, windows on the uh, walls. I did some pillars on the ends. I'm not. I might fill those in with some oak to give some like you know variants, like uh, you know pillars, like stripes kind of. But yeah, we did that, and then I got this like nice little uh, middle area, um, this little chandelier style thing. I wanted to do so I could, like a cooler shape. But it's hard to do it on even numbers. I wanted it to come to a point, but it's not going to happen with it, uh, you know, on, on even numbers. It'll have to be like four in the middle or it'll be off center. So I don't want it to be off center. So <laughs> it's going to look like that. So that's what we're going to kind of do. Well, that's what we're going to, that's what we, what we, we're starting with. That's what's going to be um, the plan for today is to like finish that up and then because uh, there's a couple other things I want to do in there but and then we're also gonna do some more work on the enchanter so a lot of building lately I think this will be the last full episode we do a lot of building and then um, I want to actually start doing a lot more with like exploring the nether I want to go uh, kill some blazes so we can get some blaze rods so we can start working toward oh no oh no oh why today is so disastrous I know there's more I know there's more where are you Oh, oh, he's just going to sneak up on me and cause a bunch of damage. I already did so much repairing today. Cut me a break, Minecraft. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, I'm feeling pretty good about this, though. Yeah, looking neat. I really like the way the stalls turned out, too. It really looks like, I don't know, they look, they look busy. And this is freaking cool. I love this thing. That's so awesome. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. So I'm feeling good about this. I might do some more, like another a couple more chandeliers. I was thinking of something else I could do with this. You guys tell me what you think. Because it looks kind of weird just as a square. Like it's a little weird. Not super weird, but it, I don't know. It could be weirder. I guess we could do more around it like half slabs. We could do like half slabs or something. But I was thinking we, we, we could maybe do something like... Well, let's quit this out of there. All right. So if we did something like... Well, I probably didn't have to pillar up to do this, but here I, I did already. I don't want to. I don't want to waste them, but I'll show you what I mean. I was thinking something like this. Cause I wanted to go for like a sh ah, chandelier effect kind of thing, right? So if we do something like this, come on, got it. We'll get rid of that gross dirt pillar. Yeah. So we did something like this. I don't know, that almost looks a little cooler. What about the corner? What if we did the corners? Oh, this is going to be a struggle. Nailed it. Come on. Oh. Oh. Almost like it better without the corners on there. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think as far as the chandelier. I mean, I, I kind of like it without the corners, but if you guys like it like this, let me know. Otherwise, if you have another idea for a chandelier, that'd be cool. But I was thinking maybe one more over here and one more over here. So that's kind of the game plan there. Also, I mean, that would pretty much do it for this building. Like, I like the windows. I like the color windows on the sides and then the clear windows on top. Really let some light in. 
These are more for decoration of the side windows. And, um, yeah, I don't know how I feel about those windows either. Like, I don't know. I, I kind of like the color scheme. It adds a little, you know, it's something interesting instead of just, you know, oak wood and whatever, birch wood. So it's it's a nice little variance over the, you know, the repetitive theme. But, yeah, I like the way this has turned out. This is looking really cool. The roof's looking pretty neat. I had it hang over uh, at least one. I think that adds a nice little effect. It's a little different than the other roofs we have. Oh, this one hangs over one as well. But yeah, this one's a little bit different, actually. But it's really, yeah, it's looking really cool. Cool. So um, what I wanted to do over here <laughs> is with the Enchanter. I believe I was able to grab some. And let me just check to make sure I'm correct. Because if I'm wrong, this is going to be embarrassing. Not here, not here, not here, not here. What about here? No. Moss stone. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. So let's uh, squirt that in there for now. So if we grab this, oh, I guess I can get rid of these too. My inventory has been a mess since I started building over there. I moved all my wood, my wood things over there, and like <laughs> my my inventory has been just packed ever since. I got a bunch of seeds, a bunch of stuff I don't need. Ugh, whatever. But um, yeah, moss stone. So really cool stone, and. Uh, We'll get some regular cobble too, and I want to start going into just randomly replacing pieces here and there with that. And then also, I have that silk touch pickaxe now, so I was able to collect grass blocks. So it's just not—it's just like dirt, but it has grass on it, which means I can go up there and replace some of the just plain dirt with the grass, which will be really nice. So let me go ahead and get started on some of that, and I'll bring you guys back when I have something pretty cool to look at. Uh, I'll talk to you in just a minute. All right, welcome back. Okay, so I think we, uh, we're making some pretty good progress. I'm feeling pretty happy with the way it's turning out. So let's take a look at what's going on. So down here, I went in and replaced every, you know, ra just randomly. I started replacing um, grass with, like, a cobblestone and uh, mossy cobblestone, as you can see. And I think it has a good effect. Um, it'd be cool to see it at night. Maybe I'll try and get you guys a shot of it at night so we can see that. But, um, yeah, I think it adds a nice little, like, you know not so I don't know clean look to it and I did the same thing up here you can see I went in and replaced every every just randomly every here and there I just uh, added in some of those same blocks up top just to make it look more like it just came right out of the ground now it's not perfect yet the last thing I really want to do here before I'd consider it complete is add in the vines I want vines to hang from the sides I still haven't found a jungle biome yet which may be what we do next time we might go on an adventure and uh, not know what's in store <laughs> and uh, see if we can track down a um, jungle biome so we can get those but I'm feeling pretty good about it the inside still looks pretty much the same up here but then when we come down we see oh all right yeah so it's got the uh, stone littered here and there I was thinking that uh, this is kind of annoying something we could do is we could come in here with some rugs and uh, that way we don't have to deal with that annoying crunch from the dirt when we're walking around. And that way, maybe it looks a little bit cleaner on the inside, you know? Because this is like a mystical, magical, you know, crazy, awesome thing. And <laughs> we want to we wanna be able to have a nice floor to walk on, you know? White carpet. Okay, cool. How many do we need? Let's just make like ooh, 45 sounds good. Let's go give it a try. Let's see what it looks like. I, I mean, I think it'll kind of fit the theme, like white, a light, like a white rug. Seems like it would fit the color scheme. I guess is more what I'm going for. So say we throw them like, ah, you get out of here. You too. Just like this. I can always take them, pick them up if we don't like it. And you get out of here, and you get out of here. And then the anvil will have to stay where it is because we can't place an anvil on top of a rug like this. Oh, let me get the torches set again. We'll do like this, I guess. It still crunches like dirt. That's kind of annoying. I wish it didn't. I don't know how I feel about the way it looks. It almost seems worse. Ugh. I don't know. It's so bright. Ah, oh, it's so bright. And then the walls still look like junk, you know, because they look like they have stuff on them. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. 
I'll just leave it how it is for now. I might end up scrapping it myself, but still tell me what you guys think. Do you like having the rug down here? Do you think it looks better that way, or do you think it looks better just without the rug? Oh, it's so bright. Oh, it's like hurting my eyes. It's so bright. Oh, all right. I got to get out of here. <laughs> so yeah, that's kind of what's going on. I, I uh, feel like I feel good. I, you know, I feel, I feel like I feel good. Yeah, yeah that's, that's great. It's great English. Just, just killing it today. <laughs> but uh, I'm feeling good about the way this has turned out. It's looking really cool. Once we get the vines, I think it'll really complete the look. But, yeah, I'm feeling happy with the way that's turned out. The uh, the shopping area is... Well, that was weird. Uh, the shopping area is looking good, too. I'm feeling happy about that as well. The one thing I'm on the fence about is obviously the, um, the chandelier type thing in the middle. Not sure about that. And then also these sides. I wanted to do something cool with the roof. Something unique. Something not, like, boring. Like, you know, just a regular roof. And, uh, I, what I came up with was these, you know, these pillar slot things, like these empty spaces in the side. I was thinking about putting, uh, windows there, but I don't know if I really want windows there. Like, I think it looks cool, but I don't know. Maybe I'll have to take, let's take some time and look at some, like, architecture, some pictures or something. If you guys have some cool suggestions about what we could do with this, let me know about that too, because... You know, I, I think it looks okay like this. I think it looks fine. From the inside, it gives a kind of a cool effect. Because you're looking in... I don't know. It's kind of neat seeing, like, those gaps right there. I think it looks kind of cool. But, I don't know. If you have guys have cool ideas, let me know. Because I'd be, I'd be up to, you know, any suggestions. So, we might screw around with that. But... I'm pretty, I'm pretty, sh feeling pretty good about the building. We've been doing a lot of buildings, so I feel like we've made a lot of progress as far as, like, uh, kind of making this place look a lot nicer. I think it does look really nice. Eventually, I want to do more with lighting. I saw this really cool trick where somebody was, like, this, they, uh, they, sh I saw, it was one of the hermit crafters, I can't remember who, but they dug out a spot like this, and then they, oh, no, I don't have one, and I can't sprint because I'm starving. Oh, no. Um, I'll just show you guys over here. It was, it was a cool thing they did for lighting work because like one thing I want to avoid is just seeing torches everywhere Torches are so ugly, and it's just I don't know I just don't want them just laying around everywhere like they're effective, but they don't look good They did something like this where they colored the carpet They dyed the carpet like a brown color like the color of dirt basically and then they threw down a uh, Thing like that and then they put that over it But you can still kind of see it a little bit, but that lights it up the light will go through the carpet and that way you have like a covered like area where there's light, but there's no real like visible source. So that's a cool idea I'm considering doing. Because I want to be able to light this place without seeing all the torches. Hence the, you know, the torches under the tree. I think that's a really cool idea. The little torch lamp posts I think look cool. Instead of just having torches laying around, they're like little lamp posts. I think those are neat too. But if you guys have other, other cool ideas for uh, lighting, let me know because I'd be open to those too. I just, uh, yeah, I'm feeling really good about the way this build has turned out. My, this is way cooler than the first world I ever played. This is, like, so much more detail. I'm feeling, I feel, you know, I feel proud of it. I feel proud of how it's turning out. And I hope you guys like it, too, because, I, I don't know. I feel like this is, it's put, put a lot of effort into it. And I, I, I think it, I think it's turning out nice. So, you guys, uh, let me know what you think. Um, if you have any ideas about things we could do as far as lighting, as far as the ceiling over there, the roof, rather. Like the, the sides of those things, the uh, holes. See if you have any ideas with that. And yeah, even any ideas with the Enchanter. Anything we've done today. If you got like a sweet suggestion, please let me know because I'd be super open to it. But uh, I think we're going to leave it there for today. If you guys liked the video, be sure to uh, hit the like button. I'd appreciate it. Um, helps me out a ton. I want to get the uh, want to get some attention to the channel, get some you know get some more followers, get some subscribers. We've been stuck at seven for like the whole time now, <laughs> so it'd be cool if we could break the seven uh, streak that we've been on. But uh, hey, thanks for stopping by today. It's been a pleasure. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And uh, hey, you guys just hey, just have the best kind of day. <laughs> See you guys next time. Later.